Hey y'all, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. As you can see from the thumbnail of this video, what type of event this is, so there's no need to really even get into it. I decided to go ahead and open this, e this event. <laughs> Lord, I'm tired. I decided to go ahead and open up this video right here because I don't know what time I'm planning on getting up in the morning and I just wanna be in good spirits. Cause um, I mean, I don't have a problem with doing it in the morning, but I've been doing a lot of prepping today. Our baby shower is in two days. And I just realized I didn't tell y'all we ain't decorating it. Cause a lot of y'all, I've been seeing the comments of people say, well, I can't wait for your baby shower. I can't wait to see what y'all do. We ain't doing it. And I was gonna do it, but when we did our gender reveal back in May, I think, um, one of my event designer friends commented and said that she would love to do our baby shower. I'm sweating per usual. Um, so she offered to do it and here we are. So I kind of know the theme, but she wanted to do something different. We didn't recommend or request anything. We just told her to do what she wanted to do. So been running around all weekend getting food and everything. What happened to people throwing baby showers for you? Now that I'm on this side of the fence, I'm like, what? People don't do that no more. And when you think about it, when I think about it, my clients, that book me for their baby showers or the, uh, not the host. Well, they hosting it too, but they are the special guests. You doing, you throwing your own baby shower and you're paying for it and everything. Back in the day, we used to get some plastic tablecloths and some balloons and just call it a day. So, sorry my son walked in. But um, we used to um, just put a little something together and come and get gifts. So, I don't know, maybe it's a new day. Uh, it's currently a quarter to 11 and this event is actually for a good friend of mine, her dad.
The next portion of this video is sponsored by Own For You. Make sure you guys stay tuned so we can go through their websites and discuss deals, items, and a bunch of other merchandise and products they have that you can use for your next event designing and personal home experience. All right, EOE family. So let me take you to the own for you LED.com landing page first, just to kind of show you what they have. You see they've got the USA stock. They've got fast free shipping, two-year warranties, and payment security options. But just scrolling through the deals of the week, I noticed that there are a lot of items that you already come in the door receiving deals and discounts um, that could really help you elevate your spaces, your home, your event spaces for a fraction of what you normally would spend to uplight a room. So uh, just scrolling down, you'll see that they've got the RGB lights, they've got security lighting and black lighting, they've got flood lights and Bluetooth speakers, as well as strip lights. And here's some more lighting options. And again, there are some more discounts and deals. It shows you which pinpoints you can put your lighting at. It shows you what kind of lighting options you have. It comes with a remote control that you can use to change the color of your lighting for different event spaces. Um, so you'll see in the latter portion of this actual event setup where I was um, plugging in those lights and I just put the option for blue since my event space was in a blue tone. I love the menus options. Um, it gives you flash deals along with that 10% discount that you'll receive once you enter your email and sign up for their website. And you can also use code ON10 to receive a further discount. Now, I want to take you to their Amazon page. It's pretty straightforward. And again, these lights are already at a fraction of the price. You see, you've got $20 off here. You've got lighting and you've got flood lights. You've got $80 lights that would normally be priced at $90 or above. It shows you the 360 lighting, which I'm really interested in for my own personal home and needs. But just scroll through their websites, check out their Amazon page, and decide what kind of lighting options you would like. And remember to use code own team so you receive a 10% discount into your email address as well so you get notified and you get plenty of exclusive offers sent directly to your emails. Guys, you do not want to miss out on this. I already have a total of four RGB LED lights that I use to uplight room, rooms and they really elevate the space. Here I am now just showing you guys what you can utilize these lights for if you are in the event designing or decor business like I am. It's as simple as taking this light, getting you a long extension cord, and plugging it in. I'm just simply behind this backdrop, getting the lights positioned like I want them, using the remote control to give it that blue light effect. If this room were pink, I could change it to pink. If it were another color, I could change it to that color. But the blue really does it justice and you see how it brings out this backdrop and it makes it a focal point. And even with this event space, once the lighting is turned down at night, it really brings out the ambiance of the room. So you don't necessarily have to put the anchors on this light to get it to stand like it is now. But again, once you turn the lights out, you really see the impact that these lights do on a room. So... Um, make sure you head on over to their website, use own 10, shop their website, enter your email for exclusive offers and deals. So you can put this in your event designing inventory repertoire. Thank you so much on for you for sponsoring this portion of the video. And again, y'all stay tuned to see what the final look of this event space is going to be.
Y'all think I like balloons? You could. They steady popping. Oh my God. These balloons kicking my tank. Yo, I am done with the event, but I completely forgot to do my like little last little B-roll. So I am just gonna insert a couple of the pictures or a few of the pictures that I took. But that's pretty much it. It took us maybe two, a little bit over two hours to set up everything. And the event starts in another two hours or so, well, another hour. But yeah, thank y'all again for stopping by and make sure you subscribe before you leave. Um, just take a look at the pictures and I'll see y'all in the next video.